Jake, welcome back. Not the result you wanted. You didn't lose the game, but couldn't quite get your penalties right in the end. Yeah, it's unfortunate. I thought the boys played really well. Um, you know, as a team, team that cancelled each other out. To be fair, but um, unfortunately, we didn't get the result. Um, you've gone up against a pretty resurgent National League side at the minute. They're in good form. They had three or four missing tonight, but you could see that they're a good side. And re really, you probably should have won that game. No, definitely. I think we um, we held our own. Like I said, the boys um, they did well. You know, a little bit more clinical in the final third, um, and we go in and win the game. But unfortunately, no penalties. It's fifty fifty and. Unfortunately, we um, didn't do the, do the job. Yeah, both sides went through on penalties in the last round. Obviously, only one could win tonight. Where were you on the list? I was um, number seven, unfortunately. Um, yeah, I don't know why, but it is what it is. I think it was late over to the chat, to be fair, when everyone was putting their hand up for him, so That's your first competitive football, though, since August the 1st, so it must be a real buzz to be back. No, nah, definitely. Um, it's good to get back out there. You know, it's the second time I've been on the grass um, since August, so... You know, it was difficult, you know, nerves running up to the game, obviously, first game back and stuff, but, you know, it's the start and hopefully I can kick on from now. How big a part has Hayden played in your recovery? Massively. Um, I've got a lot of time for Hayden. He's got a lot of patience with myself. You know, I've been difficult at times, but now he's, we've, we've worked together and we've worked hard and I'm back, back on the pitch now, so it's all good. We often talk about your injuries. It was a hard luck story last year. You had three separate injuries and... All unconnected, really. Your, your shoulder injury, particularly, real, real bad luck around this time last year. Yeah, um, you know, I've had a tough eighteen months regarding injuries and stuff. Hopefully, you now my luck will turn a little bit and I can get a run of games in and show what I'm capable of week in, week out. And what you have got, he always says it, is a manager who's full of admiration for you, and he's put a lot of faith in you as well. No, definitely. Um, I can't, I can't hold a gaffer, gaffer at all. He stood by me. Um, he's done a lot for me. He's been there, and um, I could say the whole whole club, especially. You know, that's why I had no no idea to go anywhere else. It was always going to be when I'm back fit, back here. They've looked after me, and I'm, I'm so grateful for it. And you had an excellent squad for this level last year. I would argue it's even stronger this year. Um, a lot of uncertainty at the moment about what's going to happen with the season, but positive noises today, and hopefully the lads just want to crack on and try and get promoted. No, definitely, you know, the, the team, the gap was recruited, it's, on paper it's ridiculous and to be fair, performance is showing it, unfortunately the last three results haven't been, been great, um, the, the draws, but we need to be turning them draws into to wins and work our way back up the league and hopefully get promotion that we all want. Yeah, although you lost tonight, you're, you're nine unbeaten effectively now in 90 minutes, so plenty to build on over these next few weeks. Yeah, massive, you know, being nine unbeaten is, is good, like I said. Turning them draws into wins is important now. Being a little bit more clinical in the final third and um, I'm sure we can we can kick on. And what's the goal for you to get yourself on the pitch as much as you can, presumably, and stay injury free? No, definitely. Um, I've got little targets in my head, little ones, and then build on them, you know, so I can tick them off as I go. So now I'm looking forward just to getting back in the fold, being around the lads and, you know, playing as much as possible.